day, everyone. Once again, this is Teacher Charm and Teacher Julius. We are your mathematics teachers for grade three. Now today, we will be learning about reading and writing numbers. Numbers up to 10,000. Now I want you to read with me. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. Next one we have thirty, not three t, forty, not four t, fifty, not five t, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, and one hundred. All two-digit numbers higher than 20 have a hyphen or dash in between them, unless they end with a zero. Example, 56. Put a dash or a hyphen in between 50 and 6. Letter 1, 91. 48. 35. 24. 82. And 63. Don't forget, put a dash or a hyphen in between 60 and 3. Now, let me introduce to you the abacus. This is the representation of the abacus. You have the place value of ten, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. Let me count in the ones place. One, two, three, four, five. 5 and in the tens place 10, 20, 30, and in the hundreds place you have 100, 200, thousands place we have 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, and in the tens thousands we have 10,000, 20,000, 30,000, 40,000, and then of course 50,000. In the ones place, obviously, we got five, three in tens, two in hundreds, six in thousands, five in ten thousands. So we can read the numbers 56,235. Another one. In the ones place, we got one. In tens place, we got six. Hundreds place, we got four. Thousands place, we got eight. And in ten thousand, we got two. So we can read the numbers as 28,461. Another one, we got 4 in 1's place. We got 7 in 10's place. We got 9 in 100's place. We got 5 in 1,000's place. We got 1 in 10,000's place. So we can read the numbers as 15,974. Next one, we got 1 in 1's place. We got 10 in tens place and um, we got six in hundreds place we don't have in thousands so you just put zero in the thousands place and then we got eight in ten thousands place so we can read the number as eighty thousand six hundred and eleven number one we got five in one's place we got zero again Tens place, we got four in hundreds place, we got six in thousands place, and we got three in ten thousands place. So we can read the number as 36,405. Way to go! There is another example, another way how to read the number easier. By using a place value chart. We have ones period, under ones period, we have ones, tens, hundreds. The next period is thousands period. Started with thousands, ten thousands, and hundred thousands. There are numbers there. And each three digit number represented by period. So take a look at that in ones period. Ones, tens, hundreds are in the ones period. 
and in the thousands period, you get thousands, ten thousands, and hundred thousands. It is very important we learn about period so that you can read the numbers because we read the numbers by periods. In one period, we read the numbers normally. And read the numbers by period. That is why every three digit numbers, you should put comma on it because it represents by period. So we can read that as 59,746. So we can read that as 59,746. Let's have another one. Place value, we have ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. We are learning until ten thousand, so we just stop until ten thousand here. The number eight, put it in the ones place, six in the tens place, four in the hundreds place. So, as I have said, once period, read it normally. So that is 400, that is 60, that is 8. We can read that as 468. Next one, put a 1 in the 1's place, 2 in the 10's place, 5 in the 100's place, 7 in the 1000's place. We can read as a 7,000. Reading by period, we have 500. We have 20 and 1. So we can read that as 7,521. Next, put a 5 in the 1's place, 9 in the 10's place, 0 in the 100's place, and 1's, 1 in the 1,000's place. So we can read that as 1,095. You don't need to read the 100 because it's 0. So, final answer would be 1,095. Next one, put the 3 there in the 1's place, 8 in the 10's place, 5 in the 100's place, 1 in the 1,000's place, and 6 in the 10,000's place. So, again, read by period. So, you can read it as 61,000. Another period, we have 583. So we can read that as 61,583. Don't forget to write and after the hundreds place. 7 in ones place, 4 in tens place, 1 in hundreds place, 9 in thousands place, 8 in ten thousands place. You can read that as 89,000. We got 100, got 40, and 7. So that can be read as 89,147. Next one, we got zero in ones place, we got zero in tens place, we got zero in hundreds place, we got two in thousands place, we got seven in ten thousand place. Of course, it's easy because you don't need to read the zero. So all you need to do is write 72,000 and you don't need to read zero. Therefore, the answer is 72,000. Next one, four in the ones place, six in the tens place, three in the hundreds place, zero in thousands place, ten thousands place, we got nine, so that's 90,364. You put thousand in the 90 because 90 is in the thousands period so you can read it as 90,364 next one we got five on one's place three on the tens zero in the hundreds three in the thousands and four in the ten thousands so read by period so we got 43,035 as I have said, you don't need to read the zero. So the answer is 43,035. Hooray, we are so great in reading the numbers. Oh yeah, now it's time for us to write the numbers in words.
We have here the place value chart, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. 964. 900 put to 9 in the hundreds place, 60 put to 6 in the tens place, 4 in the ones place. So that is 964 in numbers. 4,158. 4,000 put to 4 in thousands place, 100 put to 1 in hundreds place, 50 put to 5 in tens place, 8 in ones place. That becomes 4,158 in numbers. 9,805. 9,000 put to 9 in thousands place, 800 put to 8 in hundreds place. We don't have tens place, so just put zero in there and then five in ones place. So the answer is 9,805. Next one, we have 23,457. 23,000. So you put there 23, 2 in the 10 thousands place, 3 in the thousands place, 400, put the 4 in the hundreds place, 50, put the 5 in the tens place, and 7 in the ones place. So that becomes 23,457. Next one, we have 64,249. 64,000. So put 64 there, 6 in the 10 thousands place and 4 in the thousands place. You got 200, put a 2 in the hundreds place, 49. So 4 in the tens place, 9 in the ones place. So the number should be 64,249. Next one, we have 10,000. 826. Of course, 10,000, put it there in the place value, 1 in the 10,000, 0 in the thousands. 800, put the 8 in the hundreds place, and said 26. Put the 2 in the tens place and 6 in the ones place. So the number should be 10,826 according to the words. 74,104. 74,000. Right there. 7 in the 10 thousands place. 4 in the thousands place. 100 put the 1 in the hundreds place. 0 in the tens place. And 4 in the ones place. So the numeral should be 74,104. Next, 85,032. 85,000, right, put right there. 8 in the 10 thousands place, 5 in the thousands place. We don't have 100, so you simply put 0 in the hundreds place. 30, put the 3 in the tens place and 2 in the ones place. So the numeral should be 85,000. And 32. Next one, 15,000. So as you can see, it's 1,000. Put the 15 there in the thousands period, 1 in the 10 thousands place, and 5 in the thousands. And the rest, you put 0 in hundreds place, tens place, and ones place. So the numeral should be 15,000. Are you ready? So it's your turn to think and do by yourself. So, how do we write this in words? The answer is 846. You should remember how to read using the periods. I'm going to count in five seconds, and you have to read it by yourself. The answer is 1,265. I hope you get the correct answer. Next one. One, two, three, four, five. Time's up. The answer is... 502. Next one. The answer is 
4,094. Next is 7,400. Next one, 23,019. Sixty thousand two hundred and ninety nine. Oh, next one, thirty eight thousand two hundred and seventy four. Thirteen thousand eight hundred. And fifteen. How about that? Correct answer is ninety eight thousand and seven. Great job! Now you know already how to write the number in words. Now let's go to write the words in numbers. Are you ready? Again, I will count five seconds in my mind and you gotta give me the correct answer. 742. How do you write that in numbers? Correct answer is sorry, 7 in the hundreds place, 4 in the tens place, 2 in the ones place. Next one. 3,511. The correct answer is 3 in the thousands place, 5 in the hundreds place, 1 in the tens place, and 1 in the ones place. Next one. 61,774. The correct answer is Six in the ten thousands place, one in the thousands place, seven in the hundreds place, seven in tens place, and four in the ones place. Next one, eighty six thousand five hundred. And the correct answer is eight in ten thousands place, six in thousands place, five in hundreds place. Zero in tens place and zero in ones place. Next one, 90,356. And the correct answer is nine in ten thousands place, zero in, in thousands place, three in hundreds place, five in tens place, and six in ones place. We have 5,114. And the correct answer is 5 in thousands place, 1 in hundreds place, 1 in tens place, and 4 in ones place. All right, we have 26,708. And the correct answer is 2 in 10 thousands place, 6 in thousands place, 7 in hundreds place, 0 in tens place, we don't have tens, and 8 in ones place. Next one, 42,750. And the correct answer is... 4 in 10 thousands place, 2 in thousands place, 7 in hundreds place, 5 in tens place, and 0 in ones place. We don't have ones. All right, so you're the best. Thank you, children. Thank you, kids. Thank you, students. I hope you did enjoy. I hope you, you learned something from this lesson. Lesson number one.
See you again. Bye.